Hey there, TRW crew, Matt Vassallo here with the rhinestoneworld.com. So this video is going to show you what to do if you get that black box when you bring one of our TRW files into the Silhouette Cameo Designer Edition. So here we're in the Silhouette Cameo Designer Edition. We're going to go to File and Open. And then we're going to find our file. So down below here, we're going to click on our SVG files. And let's say we have this cash money design. So we're going to hit OK. And our design is going to pull in and it may look like this, where you have a big black box and not really sure if the cut files and everything are there. So everything is there, it's just hidden back behind it a little bit. So when you click on it, you'll see all of your dimensions here. And this is all of the boxes kind of put together and the designs back behind it. So we're going to go to Object and we're going to ungroup it all. So you can either go up to the Object and go to Ungroup or you can hit Control U. Then when you click off of it, and we're going to click off to the right right here. It's going to make those boxes disappear. And then click back on it. You'll see that it only took half the box because this is a two color design. So you'll see our cash money is back behind there. If we click on one of the circles, we'll see it's 0.13 inches, which means it's the right size. So I hit Control Z just to move our, back, our box back to where we got it from. It's just going to undo our last movement. And then what we're going to do is I'm going to show you that all of the cash money's back there. There you go. I just went to our fill and hit the yellow. Now, when I selected that, I didn't select the black boxes as well. I just selected barely inside the black box, so it wouldn't select those, but then it selected everything inside of it. So that's how I got it to show up the cash money. So now we're going to go to our cut style. And in our cut style, all we're going to do is click on cut right here. And that's going to give us our outline cut for our sticky flock boxes and our actual cut around each of the circles. So now our cutter is all set to cut it. And this file is pretty much ready to go. So what I would do with this, because it's a little bit larger file and to make sure that the Cameo cuts it great and we don't have to worry about anything getting offline, I'm going to delete the bottom part there for a minute. I'm going to go save as. And I'm going to call this one Cash Money 1 as a silhouette file. And then I'm going to control Z. That's going to bring back what I just deleted in that last one. I'm going to delete the cash money part this time. Move this up to the top and do the same process. Just file, save as, and I'm going to call this one cash money 2. That way I know that there's two templates in the cash money design. So there we go. We got that all ready. It's ready to send to your cutter right now. And that file is completely done, just a file that we imported. So I'm going to show you how easy it is to pull it back up later. Now it's in a silhouette file. We just go to File Open, and there it is. Easy to see, very easy to do. Just cut one template at a time, make sure it cuts perfect. So hope this helps you out. There you can see the cut lines. But those of you that have asked questions about getting a black box when you import the files, that's how you fix it. And just make sure we do have our drawing this coming up Saturday. January 26 and um, we are going to have the winner for our D3 files. What we're going to do is we're going to give away a full week's worth of our D3 files to one lucky random winner that will draw out a hat. Um, we did have our last video where all you had to do is comment on the video right below here and that will get you an entry into the contest. Well, this is another chance at another entry into the contest. So whenever we run contests like this, when you comment on the video right here below, let us know what you thought of this video. That's going to give you a second entry into the contest, which of course gives you more chances to win. So make sure to comment below right here. We're going to have the drawing this weekend, and we look forward to talking to you soon. Again, this is Matt with the rhinestoneworld.com. Hope this video helped you out, and you guys have a great day.